In this video, we will see five platforms which can be used to practice SQL online. So the first platform is HackerRank. So once we are in the HackerRank platform, just create a absolutely free account and then navigate to the uh, landing page. And when we scroll down, we'll be able to see multiple topics based on which we can select and solve different questions. Here we can see an option called a SQL, click on that. And now we'll be navigated to a page where we can see multiple questions based on different skills which are basic intermediate advanced then the difficult level is easy medium hard and when we scroll down we can see that uh, we can even select questions based on different subdomains which is basic select advanced select aggregation basic joins advanced joins and alternative queries and these are the different questions that we can solve in this platform and once we click on one question it will take us to an integrated development environment where we'll be able to see the question along with the schema of the table and on the right side we will be able to see a platform where we can actually write the sql code and also we have an option to select different rdbms based on our requirement the options are db2 mysql oracle and microsoft sql server which is basically tsql and once we complete writing the query we can click on run code and once our solution is accepted we can finally submit the code then uh, on the SQL page, it will be marked as completed. So it will be the status will be solved. And similarly, we can solve different questions through this platform. This is the first platform. Now let us move on to our second platform. Our second platform is Strata Scratch. And once we are in the platform, click on this coding questions. Yeah, then it will take us to a page where we will be able to filter out the skill set for different people which are data engineers, data scientist, BA analyst, data analyst, ML engineers or software engineers. Depending upon that, we can filter the questions. And also when we come down, we'll be able to see different RDBMS and languages. Uh, so here we can select questions based on uh, PostgreSQL, Python, MySQL, R, uh, Microsoft SQL Server, PySpark and Oracle. And there are free questions and premium questions as well but uh, there are a lot of free questions in this platform to solve so solving all the free questions will be enough for us to appear for any interviews so once we are in the platform uh, coming down uh, let us select mysql and let us click on free questions now we have multiple free questions which we can solve in this platform so we'll click on the first option which is uh, most profitable companies click on this question a similar platform uh, which is similar to the hacker rank will appear where on the left side we'll be able to see the question and the schema of the table and on the right side we'll be able to write the actual sql query and here also we can run the code and finally check if our solution is correct and submit our solution and this is the second platform which we can use to solve sql now let us move on to our third platform our third platform is LeetCode. LeetCode is a very common platform nowadays and a lot of people are using LeetCode to solve and practice SQL and a lot of other skills. So once we are in the LeetCode platform, click on this problem menu and after clicking on that, it will take us to a page where we'll be able to filter it based on multiple tags and multiple topics. And for beginners, I would suggest they can directly go to this SQL 50, which is crack SQL interviews in 50 questions. Click on this and you will be able to see 50 questions which you can solve and you can crack many SQL interviews because in SQL interviews, I have seen people asking mostly beginner to intermediate level questions rather than asking very complicated, complex questions because they only wanted to test our uh, logical thinking not the basic syntax knowledge or uh, advanced syntax knowledge mostly people will test our logical thinking and problem solving ability so i think solving this 50 questions itself will help us crack a lot of sql interviews so try to solve these 50 questions and the interface to solve the question is very similar to hacker rank and strata scratch once we click on this platform it will take us to a page where on the on the left side it will show us the question the schema of the table then the detail expl detailed explanation of the schema for the table then the question itself then we will have an example input and output and an explanation which explains why 
we reached at that particular output and on the right side we can actually write the sql query and also we'll have an option to select different rdbms based on our requirement so even we can use python pandas to solve queries in this lead code and other platforms also have such functionalities not only lead code this is our third platform now let us move on to our fourth platform now our fourth platform is sql zoo sql zoo is a dedicated platform for only sql so once we are in the sql zoo platform uh, we can see multiple topics based on which we can select and solve different question for example the first topic is select basics so let us click on the option we will be taken to a new page where we will be able to see a table and below the table we will be seeing multiple questions and concept based on which we can solve different questions so the first question is the example uses a where clause to show the population of france not that strings should be in single quotes so based on this comment we will have to write a query in the box and after successfully writing the query just click on submit sql and the result will be appearing in the right box similarly scrolling down we will be able to see different questions based on the initial table and once we go back to the initial landing page we can see multiple topics and clicking on different topics will take us to that particular topics questions and now we have clicked on sum and count uh, it has taken us to a page called as sum and count where uh, will be solve different questions based on the two functions which are sum and count so this is a good platform to solve questions based on particular topics so this is our fourth platform and finally our fifth platform is w3 school exercises so this is a platform for solving questions based on different concept so once we are in this platform click on this start sql exercise and here we'll be able to see an interface where we can fill this sql queries based on the comments given that is insert the missing statement to get all the columns for customer table so here we only have to put a select clause similarly we can see second question which is write a statement that will select the city column from the customer table so we'll have to write a select city and from clause so this is the uh, query we will have to enter here i would suggest this platform only for people who are absolute beginners in sql for others uh, this is not a very good platform but for absolute beginners in sql who are just learning to write the basic syntax this is a very good platform and coming down on the left side we will be able to see multiple topics and multiple exercises based on different topics so these are the five platforms that i would suggest you can go ahead and practice sql online without any installation and all these platforms are absolutely free and will not cost you a single penny thanks for watching and if you like the video subscribe our channel thank you